Hi, this is Mark with The Dirt Locker. Thanks for joining us here today in Los Angeles, California, where we're gonna take on a new project. This is gonna be a great project because we've got a couple of different areas. The first area is the larger area, an area between two retaining walls. They've got this terraced area that they've still got a pretty significant slope here. It's about a 30 degree slope at its, at its steepest part. We're gonna put about 138 dirt lockers in this area. And now we've got the smaller area, which is gonna be our herb garden. That's just a six by six area. We're gonna wind up with about nine dirt lockers there. So we're gonna have three people working on this project today. We're gonna to do that in about a day and a half. We're gonna have this project completely installed, backfilled with soil and planted by the end of the second day. Now, the other interesting aspect of this project is the fact that we have a curved hillside, and we've talked about cur curved hillsides in other videos, but this hillside actually curves inward, which is different. That's a concave uh, hillside, and other hillsides we've done have all been outward facing or convex hillsides. And we're getting ready to, to start this project. Hey, good morning, it's Mark with The Dirt Locker and we are on day two of our Los Angeles project and we are getting ready to put in the plants. We've got four 15 gallon fruit trees that we're gonna place in, in here, along with obviously a lot of other smaller plants. But I really wanna show what we're doing here today with regard to protecting these plants from ground squirrels and gophers. We've got a mesh here that we're gonna to use to cage the root ball to make sure that these, uh, these ground squirrels and gophers don't come and, and eat this plant away while we're trying to grow it. So what we've done here, we've purchased uh, this uh, a half inch steel mesh and we've cut it in such a way, we cut a square out uh, so that we know that the square is large enough to cover the bottom of the plant and cover the sides, right? We're up higher than the sides of the plant and now we're gonna just basically cut out uh, sections at each corner so that we're able to fold it up and it will, by the time we're done, it's gonna form a little cage that will protect this plant uh, for years to come. We've installed the dirt lockers, as you can see, all around me. Uh, we've backfilled them with soil, good planting soil. Uh, in this case, we wanted a little design effect. So we, we kind of created this wedge, which we will use mulch in and around us here. Uh, we also planted this apple tree. It's a 15 gallon apple tree. And um, we used two dirt lockers to create a ring. And the, the idea behind this ring is one of the dirt lockers is pointed down and you can't see it, but it's protecting the root ball and it's gonna help keep the soil in place if they have a, a big downfall. In the back, you can see the dirt lockers pointed up. That's gonna keep the dirt from covering the roots and creating problems because although plants like dirt, they don't wanna be covered in it. So um, we wanna protect the hillside from coming down and burying the, the, uh, the plant. The last thing that we're gonna do here is we're gonna place the plants uh, that we're gonna put into the dirt lockers all around us. And it, we've placed a couple here, as you can see. The big advantage here is that it's easier to get up and down the hill. 
put the trees there, they can stand there stable. You can really get a good idea of how it's gonna look. Um, the other thing is when you decide that you wanna move the plant around, it's easy to get up and down the hill uh, because it's just basically like going up and down stairs. Hi, I am Esperanza and this is Edgar, my husband. And we're gonna talk to you guys a little bit about um, our yard. Okay, so um, I guess a, a little backstory on why it is that we decided to go with their locker. Um, we've been at this property for 11 years now. In that time, there's been a lot of issues with what we've been wanting to do in the backyard. Uh, half of our backyard is in a slope. Um, and just, we haven't been able to figure out what to do with it. Uh, the only thing that we've actually have done is weed control and it's like every season just keeping the weeds out tumbleweed and um, i tried to plant some flowers yeah, one and time and they didn't last no and mostly because once again it's just been a headache trying to figure out what to do and behind us are the foothills which catch on fire every so often uh, so that's always been a worry we ended up getting the dirt lockers and it's been so such an amazing transformation and you know we're just so grateful it was really easy to install and I think that's what I'm most pleased with and it was so practical it's practical it's an easy product and it's really pleasing <coughs> to the eye I really like the organic form of the cells of how it's like shaped and I think that's my favorite part we're just really happy thank you dirt locker for making our house and our yard so beautiful and our garden we're really grateful for the product thank you we are here at the final stages of this los angeles project and we're just we just couldn't be more excited as to what we created here so at the beginning we had a, a hillside that was almost ungrowable it was just very difficult all they had to do all they wound up doing for years and years is just trying to keep the weeds at bay. And we created something here that I think the family is gonna be able to enjoy for years. So before we had shown you how we had installed the dirt lockers and then we backfilled them with soil. We placed the plants out in, in the design that we wanted and we came back and we put those plants in. Now uh, we've also put mulch onto this hillside we put mulch into each one of those plants to one to retain the water to keep the weeds at bay but also the mulch will break down and ultimately serve as a fertilizer for the plants themselves it's been a great project because you know we got multiple inputs from different family members as far as you know organizing this as far as setting the the plants in place and how they're going to wind up maintaining it it's just a really a fantastic feeling of being able to be part of this family structure is as they are now taking ownership of this new garden. So we've got the plants in place, we've got the mulch in place. The last thing that they were, they're gonna have to do is they are gonna put in a drip water system. We weren't able to do that in this time period, but they will be able to easily go back through and install that. Again, uh, I just couldn't be more happy for the outcome of this project. Thank you for watching this video. Hopefully you found something here that is useful to you and some way that the Dirt Locker can help you to cope with your slope. If you found any of the information useful, please like this video. Also, if you wanna get updates, subscribe to our channel. Another way to get more information is to look at dirtlocker.com. We also have other social media outlets such as TikTok, Instagram, that you can get further information on. Again, thanks for watching. This is Mark with The Dirt Locker, and we look forward to seeing you next time.